The Riemann hypothesis, the equation that makes you crazy. This equation has driven geniuses mad. It's haunted mathematicians for 160 years. And for John Nash, it wasn't just a puzzle. It was an obsession that nearly destroyed him. Prime numbers are the atoms of math, random, chaotic, yet fundamental. The Riemann hypothesis claims they're not random. If true, it cracks the code of the universe. But for John Nash, chasing this truth became a nightmare. The Riemann hypothesis is a mathematical siren. It whispers, all zeros of the zeta function lie on this line. Prove it, and primes fall into order, fail, and you drown in madness. For Nash, this line wasn't just numbers. It was a labyrinth he couldn't escape. Nash conquered game theory, but the Riemann hypothesis? It was his white whale. Colleagues say he scribbled equations in alleys, muttering about zero patterns. As his mind unraveled, so did his life. Was the hypothesis cursed, or was Nash's genius too fragile for its truth? Nash saw primes as living things, dancing to a rhythm only he could hear. But what if the rhythm was a hallucination? His schizophrenia didn't just distort reality, it merged with his math. Friends begged him to stop, he refused. The hypothesis became his demon, and his only friend. The Riemann hypothesis remains unsolved. Nash recovered, but his battle scars lingered. Was his genius a gift or a curse? One thing's certain, some equations don't just challenge minds, they break them. Smash like if you'd risk madness to solve this. Comment ghosts if primes are hiding secrets. Subscribe. The next video dives into why we live in a simulation.